Beth. Well, the Buck Days Carnival is now officially open and for the next 10 days, people can check out the thrilling rides, fun games, and of course, lots and lots of mm -hmm. carnival food. Our Cole Vaughn joins us now live from the carnival located near Waters Edge Park. So Cole, I know firsthand you love fried Oreos. I have to ask, have you gotten some yet? I, I have not gotten any fried Oreos yet, but no doubt I will be making a stop by that food truck before the night is up. Okay, so I'm here with Alex and Carlos here with the Buccaneer Commission. These guys, not only have they threatened me within an inch of my life that I better behave tonight, they do also want to tell us a little bit about what the proceeds from this tonight are going to. It's not, this is not for profit. This is actually going towards something. Absolutely. We take a, a good percentage of our profits and we allocate them to scholarships. Actually, uh, in the last 20 years, uh, we have actually distributed a million a hundred thousand dollars in scholarships to students uh, in the Coastal Bend region. Okay. And then what's re one recommendation we've got for well, tonight? I, I'm going to have fun. I'm going on the rides. If I lose this, please return to me because I'm going to hang on as best I can, okay? If, if these guys lose their weapons, I might be in better shape because uh, he's, he's trying to shave the beard with it. I'm like, hey, keep that away. No. All right. Well, that, that does it for us out here. The gates have just opened here at Waters Edge Park. We'll send it back to you guys in the studio.